Alright, writers, this is a Patreon exclusive episode. If you hadn't already guessed, we are going to be hunting for a Lagayacris. Now, I read it was supposed to be on the beach here, so I think we're in the right section. However, lo and behold, maybe this will be a short video, maybe not, who knows. But we're going to explore a rare monster den right off the bat. Now, this video will be taking place after the video that will be uploaded on November... Look at me trying to find a calendar. November 10th. So, this video takes place after that. So, you're getting some early looky-loo at what I'm doing. So, uh, let's see. Alright. Let's see what we can find. Something good, I hope. Um, so, I've been working, like, since the last... Like, the video that's going to be coming out November 10th. I've been working on upgrading my gear just a little bit. Uh, leveling up when I can. Because uh, I felt I was a little... I can't collect that. Um, Underleveled. But it seemed like the story was moving along very quickly. But I did feel like some of the battles were just... I was having too hard of a time with them. So, uh, some of my gear is indeed upgraded. Um, so... You know, I just had to do some not on camera play just to make sure I could, you know, make some money. And some of the quests were just of me just battling a monster for the sake of, you know, battling it and then collecting money for having defeated it. So there was really nothing all that special going down. Alright, I have no idea what a Legiacrus egg looks like now. Um, I'm going to have a Legiacrus replace it, provided it can swim. Ew. Hmm. It's smelly for sure, it's also quite heavy. Well, I'm going to take it because I know if I put the heavy one back, I'm going to get all light and normal ones because that seems to be the luck that I have. Let's get out of here. Eve. Alright, let's see what it says. Now, I will want to get a few, if I can, Legiacris eggs. Soggy Leviathan egg. Oh, you know what? There was a, um... So there's a Great Jaggy, and there was a Ketcha. So let's see. Now, okay. So let's go into the air just for a moment. Let's, because there was a side quest for um, Hakum Village if I bring a heavy Leviathan egg to uh, a certain person, I would get a sword skill, which I never use those. Actually, I haven't used them since I've like abandoned the Great Sword. I've been sticking to Sword and Shield. It doesn't really do anything special for me, but it is what it is. So let's see. Now I read that it would be swimming at the beach. I'm just not sure if there's more than one beach, but let's find out. It could be somewhere. Let's see. Ooh, I do kind of want to get that an egg for that because it does give dragon skills but this also isn't the beach where let's see what's down here what is that let's see let's land so oh pardon the language in the background it is not anything I would want to have you guys here normally, but unfortunately, I can't get people to be quiet when I want them to be. So is this a sleeping Ketcha? What is this? Oh yeah, it is. I guess it glided out here. I'm not gonna go... Hmm... Let's see. Because I need to find a Lagaya... Okay, so there's... I don't... Am I at the right beach, I wonder? And there is that thing. Hmm. 
All right, let's see if... Hmm. What's that? Now, is it an Ash Ketcha? Or is it... Hmm. Oop. Well, there's another rare monster den, so I might as well just go and check that one out. No harm. No harm. So let's just uh, go and check it out. And like I said, if I have to fast travel somewhere, so be it. We're going to find that rare monster den soon enough. Is there anything over anywhere? Unless I was supposed to go up some... Oh. Erder. Look at that. I just wasted so much time. But let's see what's here. <gasps> Aha! So... Let's make it count! Alright, we're gonna battle Laggy. Real quick, like. Alright. Now, I do want to get a couple of guy across for a reason, but... Alright, let's go with speed. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Let's see. We're gonna beat you up real good. All right. I'm gonna stick with my speed attack. Hmm. So I can't use my skills, but whatever. Let's see. I'm gonna go for a speed again. Yay! Poisoned. Oh, um, I thought wearing Zing gear I'd be a little more resistant. I guess not. Let's see what that did. There we go. <laughs> I like that the kinship move has been doing like four digits of damage or very close to it. Let's see. Oh, I got a lot of guy, the guy across horn. Okay, cool. So we must be in the right area at least. I guess the little guy, the little guy across doesn't show up very often. But. Alright, let's. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. Alright. Let's take this one then. I'm not sure what the guy across egg will be like. So if I have to make this a multiple part like thing, that'll be okay. But like I said, I'm gonna hunt for multiple eggs. So let's see. Weep. So let's see. What does it say? Pulsing Leviathan egg. Okay. That's better. So let's see. So it must be around somewhere. Let's take to the sky because I heard it would be swimming in the water. So that battle did go pretty well. I felt. Um, Logagros is pretty weak to, um, fire attacks, so I guess the kinship attack was quite deadly for it. Maybe I should try taking out some of the other monsters in the area. Like, we know that's the young Garuga nest, so of course we'll see it there. So let's see. Hmm. Because I imagine there's probably a spawn limit. 
to what will be like available. So yeah, I imagine. All right, so if I'm gonna take out anything, let's go for. Where did it go? Is there? Hmm. Because Xantrios has been a good partner so far. And while I don't want to necessarily give up on it, I know I need a stronger monster and a little more variety in my team, so... But, I do have plans. Don't you worry. There we go. Oh, did you see how slowly it shut its eye? That's terrible. And yet this will be good for XP. Alright. So now... I will. But not now. Later. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's the young Garuga. So there's a great Jaggy, which... The Great Jaggy is surprisingly difficult in this game. Usually that's the punching bag monster when you haven't played in a while. Hmm. That you go after to, like, kind of warm yourself back up. So let's see. Let's see. Ooh, there's all kinds of stuff out here in the water. I haven't actually explored the water yet. Now... I hope coming around the long way like this, like, amounts to... Oops. Hmm, I wonder what the Crimson Coral is for. Doop, 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 doop. I hope when the next update comes, there's some, like, when they add in new monsters. I hope Glavinus is one of them, because I would like to add... So I would think it would have that tail sword ability that I've heard that it has as one of its, um, like, a transferable trait. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. I guess maybe we'll have a quick battle with Ketcha. A queen shrimp. Let's have a quick battle with Ketcha. I think... There we go. Alright, let's see that lured out a potential laggy. Let's see if we can't find it here in the water. Now once I see one, I'll heal myself up so this way we can battle it. Although, maybe I should check out the rare monster, like the common monster den. Maybe I could get another Lagiacrus egg there. Who knows? I think it'd be kind of interesting if like you could fight a Sidious though. I'd like to see how they would like to handle that battle because the Sidious is huge. How far out can I go? Let's see. Okay, I see where the edge of the map would be. So would it be out here towards where the ruins are maybe? I hope it spawns soon. Oh no, another Ketcha spawned. Hmm. But I'm pretty sure we found one, at the very least. Hmm. 
hit the wrong button. Well, this is boring and uneventful. All right. Alright, so now that we got rid of the poison, the purple loo draw, let's see if that'll spawn us a Lagaya Cross. Now I am, during that battle, I kind of contemplated just a little bit. Ooh, I did not notice that before. I kind of contemplated just a little bit. Interesting. If I should maybe. Hmm. Check out this monster den. But let us find out. Let us see. Oh. What monster is it? Mm. Let's see. Uh. Hmm. This is laggy colored. So let's see. And it has the same pattern. No harm in having, like I said, I wanted a couple for a purpose. Leave. Let's see what we get. What we get. Pulsing. Alright, we found another one. Keeping that dream alive. Let's see. Alright. So let's take to the skies. See what we can see. If anything. So I can see the young Garuga. So if after this next like sweep, because I don't want to keep you guys watching for nothing. I'm we'll head back, we'll hatch the eggs, and then we'll move on to phase two of the plan. Shut up, Maviru. You're blocking part of the screen. Unless Glavenus is already in this, and I just don't, and I'm not aware of it. Hmm. Because so I would love to give Rathalo, well, not this Rathalos. I mean, it would be pretty cool if I get more than one, but I think it would be kind of good. Okay, so we're going to, we're going to fast travel. Back to Gildegarn. Alright, let's see what kind of laggy, kind of laggy's hatch, and we'll compare and compress the two, so let's see, because you'll see I also have plans for this little cross. Egg carton, hatch egg. Okay, so this is a sog, okay, so... Let's hatch this one. Let's see what comes out. Yay! Alright, we got it. Okay, it's got a lot of open gene spots. That's good. Alright, so let's check out this one. Alright. Now, if that came out as an ivory Lagaya crest, I would have been like, what? Alright, so... Ooh, it's got... Okay. So, no. Now, let's go to manage monsties. Change party. So, I have these two. Ah. Uh, Zamtrios. Now, this one's got its gene... It's 
Xamtrios gene in the middle, and then this one has it in the upper. No, this one has. Where? Oh, it's up here, but it's got that dragon. Maybe I can use both for the one I'm going to keep. Okay. So let's see. Legiacris gene, Thunder Breath. Okay. And then this one has. Thunder Resistance and Water Boost. And then of course a little bit. So let's see. So this one's got so hmm. So it's up there, but then I could add I could probably put both. And then this one I can just see okay, so 30. This one's got more defense, but this one. All right, so what we're gonna do is this. Right, a channeling. So now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna select the little guy, Chris, that has more open spots. And then, so this one's got it open in the middle. And we're gonna give it the spread frost breath that we've become very accustomed to using. And don't worry, that's not my original Xantrios. It's one that I found, like I went hunting for it. All right. And then this one has, so I can't really transfer that predatory, but, hmm. If only the Lagaya Crest gene wasn't like in that spot. Granted, I could have used this one's, but all right, so we got that. So this one is okay. Now what we're gonna, oh wait. Hmm, where we, oh, okay, that one was in the top spot too. So now, where's our friend the Rathalos? Oh, okay. So now this one, let's take that other Lagaya across, because we've been using the Savage Thunder Breath of, um, Oh wait. Uh oh. Is this plan not gonna go well? Oh no. <laughs> That's not gonna work at all. See, I wanted to take get rid of the Kezu and then give it the the red Kezu Savage Thunder Breath and replace it with the Lagaya Cross, but I guess that's not gonna work. Although Hmm. Let's see something real quick. I know I have something somewhere. Where is it? Hmm. Too many monsters as always. I thought I had one somewhere. I know I didn't imagine it. Here we go. Here we go. Now this is the Thunder Res, and then the Xenogurgine, but now we can add that Legiacris gene to it. Super cool. Oh yeah, I was in, by the way. <laughs> yeah, after this point, I just totally was rambling and yeah, this is that, that's why I'm cutting to the end screen right now. So thank you so much for your support. I hope you enjoyed this kind of a sneak peek, early content viewing of Monster Hunter Stories. I hope you're watching the main series over on YouTube. As always, I appreciate your support, and do let me know what you thought of the video down in the comments section. I aim to make better videos, and with your feedback, I can do that. So, as always, again, thank you so much, and I love to hear your feedback. Thank you.